All right, I hope I'm in frame here, but this is going to be a video to make myself look retarded. Um, more or less, I'm going to try to show some coyote calls. Yes, homemade because I'm cheap and poor. So, um, yeah, these are just going to be some cheap ways to do coyote calls. Maybe if you don't have the money to buy an expensive call. First of all, this one's kind of tried and true, so I'll start with it. This video will more than likely have a lot of editing done because, um, like I said, they're homemade and they don't work the absolute best. And I suck, so yeah. Um, this is a coyote call I made. I'm not gonna take it off, but I made the, uh, made the main uh, tube out of PVC pipe. I don't remember the uh, width of it, but if you can see in there, I don't know if you'll be able to see in there. Mm. Um, yeah, there's that thickness. Um, basically, I was off of a plan I found somewhere on the internet, and I don't remember where it is. So, you're just gonna have to wait. It. It's, um, it's like cut down half and then just kind of curves off. And, um, yeah, it works actually pretty well. Um, the reed is a, um, uh, piece of plastic that is from a, um, I believe it was from a detergent bottle. But, um, it's kind of hard to find the right flexibility and texture and thickness and all that but once you find it, it should work pretty well rubber bands just to hold the reed on there the blue part is the reed if you can see that um yes i will try it i'll probably look stupid but here we go Yeah, I don't know how to do it either, so that's probably shitty. But, yes, there's that. Um, this is where the editing comes in. The other, um, the other one is just a straw from McDonald's or wherever you decide to get fat from. Um, a straw. I learned this in... I don't remember, probably like the fifth grade maybe. We did a little science thing where we made uh, little kazoos out of straws and depending on the length of the straw and how you cut the reed, um, it makes different noises. Um, this one is the one I'll probably use right now. Um, you just cut it so it looks like that, kind of. Um, you want to make it flat, but I've kind of been experimenting, and it doesn't need to be extremely flat like I had been doing, so... Yes! I'm going to try it, and this is where the editing comes in, because I'm probably going to fail. So, yes. There's that. It's kind of like a rabbit um, distress. And also what you can do with this one is if you choke up on the uh, reed, you can make kind of like a crying pup sound or like a dying dog. Maybe it'll bring some attention in. Um, but it's a lot harder to do with this. So I guess we'll see how it works. I'll probably edit this.
It's a good way to give yourself an aneurysm, too. You can work on that. Okay, like I said, that one, um, is really hard to do. I really didn't show it very well. I was doing it pretty good before, and now I can't seem to get it when I'm on camera. But I guess that's the way it goes when you suck it, like, so yeah. With a little bit of ingenuity, some straws, and some other materials, you can make some pretty decent calls. Um... Yeah, I guess if you just take the time to work on it and uh, practice, you can do anything. Except get a girlfriend. I've yet to master that. Do it now!